All right, this first part's on how batteries work. And in order to do this, I want to review potential energy. Uh, so if we take mass and lift it up above a planet, well, the potential energy is increasing and increasing and increasing. And what that means is that it has more ability to do work if we drop it. Whether it's turning a water wheel or crushing a car, it can do work as it falls. This matters because electricity works the same way. If we have an electric field that comes from all these negative charges, and we lift, this positive one is attracted to it, the same way gravity attracts mass, and we lift it up, well, it has more and more and more potential energy electric. So now, as this charge moves through a wire, it can do work as it moves in the same way a falling object can do work. And this is kind of the core of how batteries are made. So let's take a look. You should be on a, I'm gonna erase all this really quick. This is toast. And this is gonna be page 13. And circuit. Vocab. And part one is how batteries work. And what I want you guys to do is add this diagram. Oops. Oh boy. Come back. Come back. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we've got this diagram, and we'll get rid of these things here. And this is just kind of a basic battery. So the first thing we need to do is what you have here in your picture. is to separate like charges. Um, so there is a potential. So things to remember is from last week, these guys love each other. These guys right here hate each other. These guys over here hate each other. They don't want to be together. They want to get together, and that brings us to part two. Separate with an insulator to keep like charges separate. Okay, we don't want these guys to combine because that would be called discharging and it would lose its charge. And finally, number three, we draw. This is what we did in class. If you're in Hawaii, you missed this. But number three is to connect the circuit. So charges can equalize. And what these guys do is once the wire is connected, they can go whoa and fly around. And the charges can equalize until we are all good. And eventually, what's happening with the battery? Well, it's dying. This battery is running out of gas. And really nice high-tech batteries, you can plug them into the wall, and if work is done to the battery, the battery can oops, recharge. It can reestablish its charge if work is done, and it will look like this again. That's how batteries work. There's more notes on the next video.